Okay, so I've been down for three weeks with vertigo. It's more of a hassle than it is a pain. I couldn't ride for my own safety. But tomorrow, I'm ready to go for a ride and I'll be riding with a special guest. Maybe I should just say it now, Zach of Makina Moto. Woo! We are gonna go around the Manila area to spread some cheer because you know the pandemic has brought a lot of people like down. I mean, like what kind of Christmas are we gonna have now? Might as well spread the good vibes because Gakimoto is all about the good vibes. Let the good vibes roll. Because the motorcycles have been in storage for three weeks of vertigo, I'm going to have to check up and make sure that they're okay. Maintenance is a huge part of riding motorcycles. I, for one, should know because based on my personal experience, let's learn from my mistakes. I let my bikes uh, down. They made tampo. Like, you know, because I left them in the garage for like three months while I went on vacation and then the lockdown. When I finally decided to start moto vlogging again, they wouldn't start. And you know, they cost me more money than it would have cost me to get these lovely products over here. One thing you want to maintain is the chain for your safety because if it gets rusty, it's brittle, it might fall off, it might break. So chain maintenance is very important. Believe me, you'd like to get some chain lube. Moving over to my products here from VS1 and Mototech. Brick and parts cleaner. Where is the chain lube? Cleans and shines and restores. Ah, over here. A lovely bottle of chain lube from Mototech. And it's anti-friction and anti-wear, protects from corrosion, safe for O-rings. Okay, opening this up. How to use, before application, clean all dirt and grease. All right, let's do that. You just wanna clean all grease and sprockets with this chain brush over here. And then later, you know, you have to uh, roll the bike so that you get the rest of the chain. Shake well before use and spray directly to the edge of the chain side blades. Okay. Hmm. And put the little spout if you wanna get into the tight spaces. <laughs> You gotta put the probe in if you wanna get into tight spaces. Okay. You watched my previous video. I let my chain get all rusty and I ended up spending 8,000 pesos for a chain alone. Chain lube, the answer to your problems. Now I'm gonna use this VS1 matte protector. Take note, it's different from original VS1 protector. This stuff is for the shiny parts, while this one is for the matte finish. So if you don't want it to be all shiny, then you use the matte one. Makes sense, right? It's so easy. All you have to do is spray it on like so, and then wipe it up with a newly washed cloth. Because you don't want to wipe these things when you've got like dust or like a pebble in it. Make sure that your rag is free of like sediment. Fun facts from Gakimoto, who's learning how to maintain her motorcycle. Drop the rag. This one over here is the original VS1 protector, which we're gonna use on the shiny parts. Cleans and shines, removes stains, and restores color. So again, you got the one for the shiny parts, and you got the one for the matte parts. All right, like and follow VS1 and Mototech on Facebook and Instagram, and check out what other stuff they've got. Let's go uh, do the rest of the bikes over there in storage. It's a lovely Sunday morning and I, I'm wearing a rain jacket because it was a bit drizzly this morning. Plus, the weather is getting cooler. I'm uh, malamigin. <laughs> malamigin uh, in English is I'm prone to uh, feeling cold. I always feel cold. Christmas season is coming up. Here in the Philippines, it's already uh, way past the start of Christmas season because it's already November. Christmas season here starts in September. I'm wondering what Christmas is going to be like this year because it's the pandemic. I've always mentioned that I have a senior mother. I'll be spending time with her. My mom's been really down during this pandemic. I wanted to get her some goodies, you know, to cheer her up. Plus, you know, she hasn't gone out of the house or anything like that. What day is it today? Sunday. Yeah, this road is open. I, I don't remember. Yeah, yeah, this is open on Sundays. I'm meeting up with uh, Zach of Makina. He had this uh, wonderful idea 
to go buy goodies and I was like yeah game on and I would like some company going to Marikina Ay, Marikina I would like some company going to Manila because I don't know my way around oh it's so cool there's like some sports fest here so I'm gonna meet up at Petron near the airport by the entrance of Neia X whoa that's a deep hole <laughs> There you all have to stop uh, They're gonna need to fix these roads again Because it's been raining You know, Manila is just add water And you get potholes <laughs> Oh, this road is known to be uh, very notorious When it comes to uh, having smooth skin <laughs> Needs a beauty redo I haven't passed here in ages But look, you'll already see this one is by the airport and fun facts, Zach is also a Paranaques Speedway rider. Oh, they're notoriously beautiful and smooth skin. <laughs> oh wow. Shoop like a stand at 583 kilometers turtle. That's because like when I got her a month after I was already doing my break and rides and then BAM! Vertigo! Nice to be out. Thank you Lord! That's the best Christmas gift ever for me was to be well I wonder what bike he's bringing today oh I don't want to wait outside the toilet I'll wait on the side Zach buddy where are you at? Uh, let's just park the motorcycle here change them batteries Whew. it's a nice quick ride in the morning and a bit rainy oh the sun's coming up goody 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 I can take off my rain jacket this is actually Sari's rain jacket it's huge that's what she said uh, it's getting hot Peace. Okay, so we'll buy Hopia and then we can give the street kids there. Okay. And then Gilmore. Okay, Zach's the tour guide because I don't know my way around. Wait long, this part takes long. <laughs> okay, got it. It's been like a long time since we've ridden together. One of my first rides to Marilake was with Zach. Oh, yeah! yeah! Woo! Is he Chinese? <laughs> Why does he know his way around Chinatown? This is exciting because um, I don't usually go to Chinatown. I'm waving at his camera. <laughs> I'm gonna video bomb this. I think Zach is like, that's a very um, hardcore mount over there. Maybe that's a drum part. Zach's a drummer too. And also, fun facts, I've done a garage visits episode to his garage on the first season of Yakimoto. Whoa. Hala, you report ka na sa makina. <laughs> oh, ooh, there's a fire. Fire! So, we're being detoured to this side. What's going on? Whoa, it's not looking good up front. Whoa, whoa Zach, close call for you, bud. Delix, dude. Oh, we're gonna make Ushasa here. Hot damn. It is a fire. Holy shit! It's a legit fire. Oh my god, a car is on fire. Oh my god, I hope the people are okay. We'll see that in the news later. I see everybody holding up a camera. Welcome to Manila. Holy crap! It's like it's not the pandemic here. <laughs> so many people out. Oh, I would give you hop, yeah. Mama, yeah, babalik kami. Oh my God, Zach! <laughs> You're here. Is that a drum clamp? I knew it! <laughs> so yeah, like and subscribe uh, to VS1 and Moto Tech's Facebook page and Instagram page. Share this video for a chance to win a care package of VS1 and Moto Tech products. Christmas season! Hey, hey, hey! This is right. Yeah, we can turn right when it's red. Oops. Yes, we can. Here we go, here we go! This is Jones Bridge. This is it, right? I think so. <laughs> mm. But I know this is Chinatown. 
yeah oh and we uh make a left here oh no it's not i was like when you make a left we will see the chinatown arc but no i'm wrong where's we going buddy <laughs> oh you better be sorry <laughs> i'm taking a bigger bike uh, it's harder for me to u-turn but yeah <laughs> peace dude looks like we are asking for directions here we are looking for Eng Bitin. Hey, I'm the best tour guide, huh? Yeah, you are! <laughs> They've got some market over here. No sign of social distancing here! Hello, Manila! Oi, oi, oi. Okay, Zach is touring us around and asking for directions along the way. <laughs> I love the mixture of dogs we see. That's like a adoption. The other one looked like a corgi. Yo, Chinatown! This looks very Chinese! Okay, I'll make a U. Apparently it's right there. Oh, where did he go? All right. Oh, I remember that auction. Ooh, yeah. Side streets. I feel like I'm in an action movie. Ong Pitten Street. Oh, this is it. Oh, I know where this is. This is Cafe Mezzanine. Uh, okay. We are over here and gonna get some hop yet. Peace out, guys. Sorry, Safe, but those are leaving all that stuff. Oh, that's an empty case. I'll bring this one. I think the last time I was here was like eight years ago. <laughs> it it it's not obvious. Would I need to take out the hobby? Ah, sakabila no. Ano ko maso? Ah, sorry. Ah, okay. Ah, sorry, kuya. Oh, so let's buy 7-Eleven. Oh, there, Zach. We didn't read the sign. Yeah. Oh, uh, damn it. And this is where we're going, and beaten. Oh, they have a side entrance. How many minutes? I know. It's been like that for months. We are early. Wow. I'm fine. So, what are we getting? Oh yeah, it's a special treat. Because we figured na it's gonna be we're gonna be giving a few, but it's gonna be a special treat. Because yung bitin sobra sarap eh. It's not also cheap, so that's the reason why. <laughs> we're giving a few. <laughs> Got my helmet. Got my helmet. Alrighty, now we are headed to give some goodies. I guess I will just strap this on here. <laughs> there you go. That's how we rock in it on a motorcycle. <laughs> Whoa! That's a long stick! Alrighty. We'll find our way to Ross Boulevard and we're gonna try to look for that kid whom we spoke to early on the road and also try to find our way out of here. <laughs> Give some hopia. Hopia ube. Hmm. Hello. Thank you, Paul. That's where you are. Alright, do it. Merry Christmas, y'all. We are going to get on the boardwalk. It's so cute, these kids shared with their grandpa or their dad, I think. And now we are on our way to our next destination, 
to uh, get a Christmas parol over at Gilmore. It would have been nice to go somewhere else to get a Christmas parol, but you know, times are a, a bit difficult. You know, I have to get a medical clearance to go through um, other provinces. Yeah, you need like a medical certificate, a swab test, or something like that. I'm glad even after being down, my bikes are in great condition. Got chain lube on there. Uh, they're looking shiny, but it rained. <laughs> I cleaned it up yesterday. That's okay, I'll clean it up again later. Got some of that VS1 protector. Protects the plastic and keeps it shiny. It's perfect, because I like my bike to be shiny. Hi. I'm the tour guide now. The tour guide? Yeah. You. I'll take you to Gilmore. Okay. We won't get lost. <laughs> I love those socks. Check out those socks. My mom is uh, she likes these decorative things. <laughs> and she always finds it festive if you put up a parole outside the house. Our house was always decorated for Christmas, so usually the paroles come from Angeles, uh, Pampanga. And that's my mom's hometown. But since you know I couldn't go with all the travel bans, I was like, oh, next best place would be Gilmore. Oh, slowing down over here. Why is it slowing down? Voila, merging. I'm glad they made these barriers like smaller. But now you'll notice it's very tight still. Look, even the Maserati is like on the line. I really think they should rethink this bus lane on the left side. Look, 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 there's that thing over there. It's like an open barrier. Anyone could have gotten into an accident. Woo! Nice flyover. I'm glad I'm not so afraid of heights. I don't mind going up these flyovers. This is where I know to get Christmas parole. So a parole is a star. It's supposed to be like, you know, the star on the uh, Belen. The star that led the three kings to where it is. They were led. Oh, these are fancy capi shells ones. Just like the ones they make in Angeles. I just want to get a small one because I don't know how I'm going to put that on my motorcycle. Mom. Hi. How yung yung this? One to four. One to four? Yes. Oh, okay. How yung ilaw ilaw nun? Ay, maganda. Oh, okay. Ito ma. Wala nang tawad? Ah, oh, sige, sige. May, wa may warranty naman ka man. Ilan po? Ilan? Isa lang, isa lang. For your mom, right? Yeah. How young is she? 67. Okay. M way above senior. Thank you. 800 po. 800? Yes, Ba't mas mura sa kanya? Mas nalit yan. <laughs> Oh, patingin nga yung itsura nun. Is this nice? Yeah! And they're capi shells. It's what? It's made out of capi shells. Okay. Yeah, same. But I got the plain white lang. Ah, okay. How much is that? One, two. One, two. This has color. Eight hundred. Yes, sir. That's right. Eight hundred. I have one now. Four hundred. So, it's like So, it's a little bit of a I like this one. It's a little bit of 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 a little bit so I got my parol over here. Oh wait, I didn't pay the ate for it yet. Oh, but show me discount. <laughs> Thank you, Zach. <laughs> Alright. Do you know your way back? Yeah, I know now. Okay. I'll see you. Merry Christmas, Zach. Happy holidays and thanks for being my tour guide <laughs> and getting me lost. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Bye. Thank you, Merry Christmas. Bye. Mom does not know that I'm showing up. 
in her Christmas parole. Spread some Christmas cheer. Yeah, I had to do wash up first. Oh, what is this? I look horrible. Look at that helmet line. Oh, Mommy! Happy. Hi! Surprise! Is it, uh, I didn't know that you were coming. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I didn't know. This is supposed to be a What's surprise. That? What are you bringing? It's a parole. Oh, wow! <laughs> yeah, we were supposed to go to Angeles, but we can't travel. So they make these capuchal things in Angeles, right? Yeah, they make them there and they said, where did you finally buy this? Oh, just in Gilmore. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> they get it from Pampanga and Parole. 